safely protecting yourself against hackers in the cryptocurrency realm. Okay, so you've decided to dive into the cryptocurrency market. Great. But remember, with great power comes great responsibility. And by power, I mean the supercomputer in your pocket kind of power that can manage your digital currency investments. But here's the kicker. As soon as you step into this online financial wild west, you become a target for the digital age bandits. Hackers. Cryptocurrency basics. First off, understanding the basics of cryptocurrency security is like knowing to wash your hands before eating. It's hygiene 101. Cryptocurrencies are built on blockchain technology, and while it's inherently secure, the environment around it isn't always. We're talking about wallets, exchanges, and personal security practices. These can be the Achilles heel in your investment strategy. Cold wallets, your crypto Fort Knox. Hot wallets are on devices connected to the internet, which is kind of like leaving the keys in your car while it's running. You're practically inviting trouble. Cold wallets, on the other hand, are not connected to the internet. They are physical hardware wallets that can be as small as a USB stick, but as secure as Fort Knox. Think of it as the digital equivalent of a safe deposit box. When I'm in Portland, sitting in one of those hipster coffee shops, sipping on a single origin brew that costs more than gasoline, I often think about wallet security. Because here's the thing about cities like Portland, they are tech savvy. And where there's tech, there's hacking potential. Sturdy passwords and two-factor authentication, 2FA. All right, the password 12345 might be easy to remember, but it's like putting a steal me tag on your investment. Use complex and unique passwords for each of your accounts. Mix it up with numbers, symbols, and letters, both uppercase and lowercase. Use a password manager if you have to. Then there's two-factor authentication. If it's SMS versus an authenticator app, go for the app every time. Why? Well, phone numbers can be spoofed, hacked, or subject to SIM swapping attacks. An authenticator app like Google Authenticator or Authy gives you a one-time code that's so much harder for hackers to intercept. That's not a phishing rod. It's a phishing email. Phishing scams are the bread and butter of hackers. These aren't the Nigerian prince wants to give you money emails anymore. They're crafty, cunning, and, well, pretty convincing. Always double-check URLs and email addresses. If something looks fishy, don't click. Simple as that. Keep it updated, like your morning brew. Just as I love having the freshest coffee beans from a local Portland roaster, your software needs to be fresh, too. Regular updates patch security glitches quicker than you can say, this coffee's cold. Updates are like vaccinations for your digital devices. They're essential for a healthy system. Public Wi-Fi is a no-go zone. Investing in cryptocurrencies while on public Wi-Fi is like counting your cash with the window open in a bad neighborhood. You're inviting unwanted eyeballs. Either use a secure network or invest in a reputable virtual private network, VPN service. The latter encrypts your data, shrouding your online activity in mystery. Stay informed. Knowledge is power, and in the crypto space, staying informed is your radar for incoming threats. Follow legitimate sources and thought leaders who know what they're talking about. This isn't paranoia. It's about staying one step ahead. So, to wrap this up, practice good security hygiene. Use a cold wallet, create ironclad passwords, authenticate, watch out for phishing, keep your systems updated, avoid public Wi-Fi, and stay informed. The world of cryptocurrency is exciting, but it's also the wild west of finance. Stay safe out there. It's a digital gold rush and you don't want to be the prospector who gets their pockets picked.